Hey guys, welcome to Star Wars 101. Today we're going to be going over a little bit of the history of how Darth Xana ended up becoming the apprentice to Darth Bane. Xana, also known by her nickname Rain in her childhood, was born on the planet Samav Rit. She lived there with her parents and three cousins, Derivit, Harden, and Root. At the age of 10, Rain along with her cousins were discovered to be force sensitive by Jedi recruiters for the Army of Light. The Jedi obtained permission to take the children to Rusan to be trained in the ways of the Force and help aid Lord Hoth in his fight against the Sith Lord Khan and his Brotherhood of Darkness. However, during her time on Rusan, the Sith army attacked the Jedi camp and Rain was separated from the group and became lost. Fortunately, she met a native creature called a Bouncer. Her name was La and her species could use the Force to sense the emotions of others and project their own telepathically as a form of communication. La helped Rain survive on the foreign planet by finding her shelter. The two quickly developed a strong friendship, but it only lasted a few days. After Khan detonated a deadly weapon called the Thought Bomb, which devoured all Force sensitives within miles of its origin, including himself and his order, a Jedi Master, Lord Trafala, sent out a group of soldiers to search for any survivors. The toll that the war took on the planet drove many bouncers to insanity. Therefore, the team was given orders to shoot all bouncers on sight in case they might attack. While Rain and La were wandering in the woods, several close shots rang out and La dropped to the ground dead. Two Jedi ran up to Rain, asking if she was hurt. She was extremely sad, but at the same time festering with anger. When she finally let go of her emotions, she screamed sending a force blast towards the men, knocking them back and snapping their necks in less than a second. What she didn't know was that by her actions, she attracted the last living Sith Lord, Darth Bane. Bane heard the scream and sensed the death of the Jedi. He quickly tracked down where it had occurred and found a little girl kneeling over a dead bouncer. Darth Bane was able to guess what had happened and could feel the hatred burning inside of her. Bane took her on to be his apprentice, believing that she could prove worthy to become the heir to his title as Dark Lord of the Sith. They traveled to Ambria where she learned the ways of the dark side, how to fight with the double-bladed lightsaber, and many other things including the ancient art of Sith sorcery. Eventually, Rain decided to take on her birth name for her title as Darth Xana. So guys, if you enjoyed this video, then please drop a like below, subscribe if you want to hear more, and if you have anything that you think we left out that might be a little bit more important, or if you just want to say something, then please leave a comment in the section below. We'd love to hear them. And other than that, guys, just have a great day.